Hello and welcome to Poland Daily Travel. In the next series of episodes, we're headed south, that is south of Warsaw, to the Świętorzyska area. Here in the Holy Cross Mountains lies the town of Sandomierz. It's an extraordinary place still exuding its medieval flavor. Its tilted marketplace is remarkable. I've never seen one like it. Talk about the Leaning Tower of Pisa. This whole marketplace is leaning. From the medieval Opatov Gate, you get a good view of the surrounding area, with the Vistula River stretching off in the distance, both north and south. There are many mysteries in Sandomierz, including hundreds of meters of underground passages. There's also a personal favorite, and that is the recreated medieval armory. Here you can sample weapons, armor, clothing, you name it, all from the medieval period. Later in the day, if you have a mind to, you can leave the town and catch the sunrise out on the edge. That is the edge of town. On the edge of town, you will find the Pepper Hills, a quite remarkable and unique set of hills. Hundreds of millions of years old, the Pepper Hills are a perfect place for hiking and just relaxing. It's a marvelous preserve of ancient habitation and the perfect place to watch the sun go down. So come along with us to Sandomierz. It's quite unique. I'm willing to bet you've never seen anything quite like it. So watch Poland Daily Travel. After all, we do it for you. So take a little bit of time and like us on Facebook or on YouTube. And if you're really daring, subscribe. That's Poland Daily Travel. Hello, everybody, and welcome back. We are in the Knight's Armory in Sandomierz. This is Poland Daily Travel, and we are doing it medieval. Yeah. We're doing <laughs> medieval. We're underground yeah. in, this, uh, in this armory with Wukash Velkin. Yeah. So, uh, if we explain lots of details about the history, um, you have a uh, time to dress. We have the special chamber, mm -hmm. uh, like you walk and you dress. Uh, mm -hmm. Let's go in there and have a look. Okay. Yeah. So, like I said, if we talk about the history, it's history from 11th century to 17th century. That's mm -hmm. why we have a multiply of choosing choosing of, of your dress. All right, so you could... So you yeah, could, like noble guy. This yes. is like a noble man, if yes. we could put that on and show what that would look like. Uh, here of you go. Course. Hey, that fits perfectly. Yes. It's almost as if it were made for me. What do you think about that? Wait, let me turn my hat around. Okay. So actually, noble, you Oops. are noble. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that making it? My head's too big for this noble hat. Yeah, this is, I have a 21st century big head, but uh, nonetheless. On the past, people were smaller. They were smaller, yeah, 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 they didn't have exactly. this. So, it's, so yeah. look, look on, your, on, on the mirror, so, so looks lovely. Good Lord. Yeah, Game of Thrones. Yeah, that's, uh, I think, uh, I, may, I have to go try out for the Game of Thrones, see if they'll let me on, what do you think? Yeah, but maybe like. No, nah, I'm probably too tall. <laughs> Just kidding, you know. Oh, come on. We have a tall is tiny. people, but yeah. not this size. Probably some okay. people have this kind of size, but I anyway. think this looks good with a baseball cap. No, it doesn't. Mm, yeah. uh, but <laughs> still, we have a lot of about uh, fashion from the past. We Thank take you, sir. a lot of... So these are costumes that people can try on. That's the point, yeah. right? And uh, get into the mood. All yeah, right. sometimes, uh, you know, yeah. we have our okay. parents, we have your children, uh -huh. everybody wants what else, to what else we got? dress. So, uh, a yeah. different uh, uh, time, because this chambers is, uh, chamber is from 10th century mm -hmm. to 15th century. This is 10th century, yeah. Yeah. so this Vikings. is Viking armor. Vikings, yes. That is Viking armor. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, sometimes... So uh, my Vikings. ancestors were wearing this. Yeah, so yeah. maybe, but still... They're Viking, if they were Vikings, yeah. yeah but we, we, we... But this looks like Chinese or something. Uh, or it's Mongol. A, uh, it's actually from uh, east part of Europe, but mm -hmm. uh, from uh, uh, Russia or... or um, it's Mongol to me. Almost, With a flat nose? Almost, almost. Yeah. But Mempo, the mask of samurai right. in Kabuto helmet, right. looks uh, similar. It looks so, similar. So the, it? Yeah. this face yeah. made fear. 
So, yeah. you know, so... This and what's is, this? This is like some kind of mortar or something? Since 14th century, we have uh, black powder in Europe because... From uh, the Chinese? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And Marco Polo, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but if we talk about black powder, yeah. that was, uh, you know, um, deadly uh, force to uh, kill uh, knights. You know, the foot soldier not afraid cavalry anymore. They weren't because afraid. Because you have a so, uh, uh, support of mm -hmm. black powder. Because you have cannons. Yeah. Yes. Uh, these are these are, but these are more like mortars we can see over here, it, right? It's from that? Battle of Grunwald, 15th century. So wow. This What's the date of Grunwald? Uh, 1410. Every schoolboy knows. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Every schoolgirl knows. Uh, yeah. uh, the biggest, like Frenchies, Agincourt yeah. or Crecy. Yeah. <laughs> so no, this is huge. memorable yeah. uh, battles. And, or 1066. Uh, yeah. Ten, yeah. 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 It's, uh, Hastings, uh, Hastings, William the Conqueror, That's arrived correct. to England. As, so uh, so, uh, whoa, so if good. we talk about this yeah. cannon, you have uh, mm, like maybe 20 kg of, of uh, stone ball. Mm -hmm. After then, in 1453, uh, Turkish uh, army arrived to Constantinople mm -hmm. and arrived with huge cannon. It's uh, uh, um, his uh, heavy like 19 towns and sent ball about 500 kg on mm -hmm. the range 1,500 1, meters. Wow. So, you know, this is like when we talk about the tanks from First War and Second War. Only wow. 20 years and you have a completely different tank. So if we talk about black powder, on the first, this cannon looks uh, maybe not deadly, not scary, but it's still... It was you, scary then. Uh, yeah. it's, it's maybe made the noise, yeah. and this is like mental weapon. It was uh, like magical weapon in a sense, yeah? When, yeah, probably some yeah, emotional weapon. Yeah, 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 but still, as, as you said, psychological. I, yeah. If we talk about bowmen, you yeah. should practice this guy, training this guy, a few years. If we talk about someone with the arquebus or different pistol, it's like two weeks, one month. So much, much easier. Yeah, a bow being much more difficult. To